So I want to test and see. I know it's an open diff. Um, I know open diff is not obviously the same thing as an LSD or a welded, but on wet conditions or snow, as we'll see when winter comes, I should still be able to get this thing sideways and keep it sideways without too much trouble. It was supposed to rain today. Look at outside, by the way, look. There's mad clouds over there. So we need to go to a locale that is not so populated. And then I can do some launches and things and see how open is this open diff. I'm not even sure if this is a truly just a mechanical open diff or if it's an electronic LSD or what the case is. I know the only 46 that came with an LSD is an M3 and I think some ZHPs you could get a, a, an LSD package but it's not like with the E36s where you could actually just get like a winter pack and have uh, an LSD. Because like Frankie, which is a 318 IS, came with an LSD because it was a winter package because it's a Canadian car. The real issue here is when I launched the car, for example, with traction control on, like everything normal, I didn't mess with anything. First to second gear chirps, this car has the power to do it, but then the, the throttle gets cut because of the traction control so there goes my launch second gear no power and then it takes it like two seconds to recalibrate and be like oh, okay now you can drive again and then I can go so if I was ever to race I would never race though but I'm just saying if I was to race I would definitely lose the Prius and it would be no fun for anyone see I wish I had like locations there are parking lots but there's also security in all of those parking lots I also want it to rain. You gonna film me? Yeah. That's just my head. People just, love you. Just my face. My piles. Oh my god, look at this crossing. Wrecked. Oh. I don't think I got any of it. Uh, you can't really. Oh, this is an 80, guys. Let's launch. I've noticed that I'm having a really difficult time with the throttle in this car. Maybe because it's electronic, I don't know, but every time I get to the end and I'm about to shift into the next gear, I kick up the throttle somehow. I don't know how. Someone teach me how to drive. I could do a burnout in the cemetery because I'm about to kill these tires. No. That joke was deadly. Just no. That joke was deadly. No. I killed it out there. Also, can you show them the state of the tents in this car? It looks like a bear attacked it. Uh, what is that? Do I go race car driver or do I go farmer? I always drive farmer style. I belong in a tractor. Although this car is... Uh, door panel is too high up and this is too too far down this is a mini minivan mom driving situation if you put your hand down like this is this a road is this a road okay everything's flying everywhere that was an unsafe stop those are some precious Britney Spears CDs that you just sacrificed or I should say risked Britney bitch you ready for this? Traction control off. See, show when you turn it off, lights come on. Okay, I need to step back. That's funny. What's so funny? Oh, it's funny that the uh, speedometer lost completely track of how fast I was going completely I was going about 60 70 easily and it said that I was going about 20 so wheel speed sensor probably not the best oh I can do a perfect test of LSD or not all right so if you got yourself a new vehicle and you'd like to know whether or not you've got an LSD or an open diff you get to a surface like this one side is on gravel, the other side is on concrete. And what's going to happen is the side that's on gravel is just going to completely go 
mental and the side on concrete is never going to get any grip. See, here's the thing. This is the wheel that was on gravel. And as you can see on the concrete or on the pavement, nothing. So absolutely as open as it gets. And that's how you know. This sucks. What is this? Where am I? What year is it? Oh my God. Well, why did you turn right? Well, because I'm trying to get us back into town. No. And this is the obvious way to go when there's no pavement. All these SUVs are like, what are you doing, bro? That guy's flying. All right, so we're gonna try and see if this thing will even go sideways. Okay, so not the best because of the open diff sitch. There's a, an I-8, how nice. It can get sideways, but I've maybe like on wet. If I go to track, I feel like I could probably do some fairly decent drifting just by throwing it. More like a, a body weight thing and second gear will definitely do it. But uh, doing donuts, not gonna happen because it's a one wheel peel. It does have enough power to drift nicely though, but it's not the same kind of thing that you get out of Frankie because it doesn't have the torque. See, with Frankie, you just pop it into second or third. You just turn the wheel and press the gas. That's all you have to do. And the wheels will spin out immediately. I can probably accomplish the same thing here if I get a high ratio diff and weld it. Um, I did look on forums and stuff at ratios. Basically, if you want a really good ratio, you want to get it from an automatic. They have higher ratios. I want to say 328s, 325s. Actually, the 330s HPs I think, had the highest ratios. Either way, nothing LSD that I could just pick up and put in, unfortunately. So someday it's going to be welded, unless I decided I'm going to splurge and spend like $2,000 on a quaif. A quaif? Yeah, it's called a quaif. So yeah, that was a little bit of testing out to see what a stock 330Ci can do. I do have nice new tires and I do have uh, dry. Like I said, I, I wish it rained. That was my hope originally. Like, look at that. It passed right by us. And nothing here. Super nice and sunny and awesome. And over there, people are just drifting. And you probably drift a minivan over there. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'm gonna do some more playing around. Next thing probably is gonna be putting in those bits that I picked up from the junkyard and whatever else, I got a bunch of stuff to fix. I'll, I'll give you guys an update of like a checklist of things that need fixing. So see you guys next time.